He has the strongest memory in the world, known as a unique legend. His name is Stephen Wilshire. When he was two years old, his father died in a car accident. He was diagnosed with autism at the age of three. He doesn't like to talk. There are even no friends. His only hobby every day is painting. He was sent to a special school at the age of five. With the efforts of teachers, he didn't fully learn to speak until he was nine. Stephen showed a strong interest in painting city scenes. He relied on his imagination to draw a picture of what the city would look like after the earthquake, included in the textbook. At the age of 10, Stephen showed great ambition. He was once named the most outstanding child painter by the Royal Academy of Art. In 2001, 27-year-old Stephen participated in the BBC TV program. After a helicopter ride over London, a detailed and beautiful aerial illustration was drawn in three hours. The image shows the entire landscape within four square miles. It contains 12 historical attractions and more than 200 buildings. In 2005, Stephen once again demonstrated superhuman observation, memory, and spatial abilities. He took a helicopter tour around New York for 20 minutes. It took him three days to paint a stunning panoramic view of New York on a canvas 20 feet long and 2.6 feet wide, all from memory. Even the details of some landmark buildings are drawn accurately. It's like a camera. Not only can he remember everything he sees in front of him, and it can be restored to scale. Therefore, it is known as the body camera. Stephen also successively drew 12 famous urban landmarks and more than 200 urban buildings, such as Rome, Hong Kong, and Tokyo. The Tokyo panorama is 52 feet long. It is also Stephen's largest work to date. Every building and even every window in the painting is faintly visible. In 2006, Stephen was awarded the Royal Medal of Honor and opened his own permanent gallery in London. All of his works will be permanently exhibited in London.